welcome back to my channel. I feel like I haven't done a video like this in so long. So if I'm a bit rusty, then bear with me. Um, obviously, today's video is with Princess Polly. You guys know I'm obsessed with Princess Polly. I've worked with them for years. I've shopped with them for years. They are just probably one of the quickest online stores. Like if I want something, it's here the next day. Their shipping is so quick and you get free express shipping on all orders over $60. So I feel like since my last haul, my style might have changed slightly. I think I'm in like my tonal neutral girl era. Like I hardly really wear any color anymore. When I'm purchasing stuff, I do often think, how am I going to wear this and how many times can I wear this and how many different outfits can I get out of this particular piece and most of the time majority of the stuff that I do buy these days they are like timeless pieces that you can wear over and over again and you can mix and match with stuff that you already have in your wardrobe I also do have a discount code for 20% off I will leave it on the screen I'm pretty sure it's love jazz but I'll also leave every single item that I do mention in this video down below along with my size as well for reference obviously the outfit that I'm wearing is Princess Polly I love Love this top so much I love that you can wear it as a set you can wear the scarf with something else you can also wear this boob tube with something else I actually wore this exact top with a pair of jeans over the weekend I will insert a photo here with my Ugg boot and it was a vibe I was so comfy in it it's not like that scratchy sort of knit material I get so many people asking me where I get this singlet from every single time I wear it I've had this one for a while I really love this belt I would say this belt is more of like an on-trend piece but I feel like belts in general are coming back in obviously this kind of belt and like chunkier belt i i feel like are more of like a trending piece but like just like belts in general that like everyone has people are starting to wear it again and i'm here for it like i love wearing belts to kind of like tone down uh, like a dressier outfit i feel like it makes it a little bit more casual I actually got the inspo for this outfit from the princess play website i'm pretty sure the model that was wearing this exact skirt had this outfit on or something really similar and I absolutely loved it I didn't think I would like like a belt like this I just didn't think it would suit me but I feel like it's really subtle with this outfit on it kind of just like elevates the outfit and I'm obsessed this skirt fits really really well too I just popped in some gold hoops I feel like it just completed the look this could possibly be my favorite fit of the haul, but I haven't even tried anything else on yet, so. I feel like another jacket that's worth a mention and that I also get so many questions about is this beige bomber. Now, they still have these on the website. I'm pretty sure they were sold out for a while, but they're back in stock, I'm pretty sure. And yeah, I've washed this so many times. I actually have a little stain on it. I need to wash it, but this is probably one of my most worn jackets. Like, and I've had this for probably, I want to say like four to five years. Like I am just obsessed with the fit, the color, and it washes really well. Okay, I thought I would keep the skirt on because I actually really like how this looks together. So this is like a knitted, I would say, like a thick knit top. Again, not itchy. Um, it's actually really hard to find affordable knitted tops that aren't itchy. This one is not itchy at all. I actually really... Really love the fit and the length of this top. Yeah, I feel like this is definitely more of like a Euro summer sort of outfit or even just like Gold Coast in general. I feel like people wear this stuff all the time, whether it's summer, winter. Okay, if there's one thing that every person needs in their wardrobe is these Archer pants from Princess Polly. Like these have gone viral for a reason. Everyone talks about these trousers on social media. Like every haul that I see from Princess Polly, everyone is raving about these bloody Archer trousers. And I'm telling you, out of all the trousers that I own, I actually own quite a few from heaps of different brands. These are definitely my favorite. I've got them in this color, I've got them in the black, and I've got them also in the brown, which I couldn't find. I was gonna show you guys, but I couldn't find them. They are the perfect fit. And then I just paired it with this top. This is just a basic, it's kind of almost like swimsuit sort of material boob tube. I like everyone needs some sort of boob tube or even boob tube bodysuit. This is actually a bodysuit. It's not like a boob tube that I've tucked in. Okay, I don't think in particular this cardigan would go with an outfit like this. But I did want to show you because I have been wearing this to death. It's like an oversized cardigan and it is so soft and warm. I am obsessed with vests at the moment. This is like a linen one, so I feel like this particular style could be worn like more dressier or even more casual. Like you could even pair it with some linen pants um, and some thongs. Okay, this is the next top that I've paired with the trousers. I like that it is a little bit lower, so you can actually like 
you know, have it sit like over your trousers or you can tuck it in. So it kind of looks like a bodysuit vibe. I feel like with this top, you probably would need some nipple covers or a strapless bra because it is a little bit on the sheerer side. But I feel like this outfit is a prime example of a fit that will not go like out of fashion or out of trend. It's just like a really simple, chic outfit that you can wear all year round. This next top I am obsessed with. I actually don't have any long sleeve knit tops in my wardrobe now that I'm thinking about it. Um, but this is so stunning. I love like the off the shoulder detail. I love that the sleeves are a little bit longer and it's not like an itchy material. This is what the top looks like untucked for reference. I probably would prefer it tucked in or even just like, I don't know, one side tucked in and then like the other side like out loosely. But yeah, I'm obsessed with this top. Okay, so I currently have zero color in my wardrobe. Like I mentioned before, I'm in my like tonal neutral girl era and I feel like I need some color every now and again in my wardrobe. So I chose this tank top. It's like a, again, like a swimsuity type material. It's really, really stretchy and I love the color of this. I feel like on camera it's coming across as maybe a little bit more brighter than it is, but it's like a deep burgundy red. I just realized these aren't even the archer pants because these are the archer pants and they don't have this strip along here. Now I've just confused myself because I was thinking that these are the archer pants when these are the archer pants, but they fit the exact same. That is so weird. I've had those ones for the longest time. These ones I actually got recently because I didn't have a black pair, but I was certain that these were the archer pants. Maybe these are like the old archer pants or maybe just like not the archer pants, but they fit the exact same. Um, so obviously they do have this color in these pants, which are definitely called the archer pants. Wow. Personally, I don't think I would wear these together. I would definitely wear it more with like a lighter trouser or a lighter skirt. I just don't think that this color combo really works for me. So I'm going to try on a different top. Okay, this top's a bit fun. I was going to pop on this belt, but it's actually got gold, like a gold buckle, whereas obviously the whole moment of this outfit is the silver, and I don't actually have a belt with a silver buckle. So I've just got like a plain black bralette underneath it because it is obviously like a sheer top. I absolutely love this. Like I feel like, again, a top like this is just like a really nice like top to have in your wardrobe. Yeah, I feel like it wouldn't be a haul without a matching set. You guys know I've got so many sets like this, like shorter sleeve button up with the matching pants. I'm obsessed. I wouldn't normally wear a set like this buttoned up. I would normally do the tuck. I'll show you guys how I do tuck it. So I do always have a bralette underneath. So I've got like something to tuck it under, but normally I unbutton pretty much all the buttons except for the top one or sometimes even the second one. And then I just grab half of it and just tuck it under. Sometimes you need to like grab a few things and that's how I'll usually wear sets like this, which I mean still looks really cool. I will mention these aren't like elasticated pants. They are, they do have like an elastic on the back, but they are like a zipper on the side. So they are a little bit on the tighter side on the thighs, but they do have like quite a wide leg um, at the ankles. Okay, this is the very last outfit that I've got for you guys. I did get another off the shoulder. This is a bodysuit this time though, in black, just because I feel like it would just go with everything. And then, yeah, I've just paired it with those same beige trousers that I put on at the beginning of the video. Let me know if you want me to film more videos like this more frequently on my channel, because obviously I'm in like my fashion girl era and I'm obsessed with like putting together outfits. If you did want any other like fashion related videos then let me know in the comments down below. Again, my discount code for Princess Polly is jazz20. Again, I'll leave everything that I mentioned in the description box for you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you very soon. Bye.